Chief Operating Officer CP Plus. Uh, CP Plus India is largest security and surveillance player based out of Noida. We got our manufacturing plant in uh, Tirupati uh, in area of about uh, 20 acres, uh, having a production capacity of 10 million devices a year. CP Plus uh, today is employing about 2,000 plus employees in its production plant and uh, we are further augmenting our production capacity uh, to make it export oriented only with exporting to Middle East as well as European countries. Talking about uh, CP Plus with respect to product range per se, today right from your turnkey integrated solutions which are required into the smart cities or uh, you know your uh, railways, uh, defense projects, you know, the power plants, to the commercial security, CP Plus has got a line array of products to suit to every need. Uh, here uh, we have launched multiple products in uh, the uh, current on-way exhibition, uh, wherein we are talking about facial recognition, we are talking about uh, command and control center, we are talking about a host of other products which are relevant to various verticals within the government. Uh, as a milestone to CP Plus, uh, we have uh, to accredit the latest comb which happened in uh, uh, Allahabad. So that was uh, done by us. Uh, it was uh, the project was finished within a record time of uh, two months, uh, and uh, post that the Allahabad smart city has also been done by us. The recent 1.4 lakhs cameras in Delhi that uh, also uh, has been undertaken by CP Plus. Uh, about 500 plus railway stations are already put in surveillance by CP Plus. Uh, that's what the whole strength of CP Plus is. However, the uh, research and uh, development bank uh, that has to credit a lot of uh, uh, solutions which are tailor made to the customers. Uh, to this uh, uh, exercise, I also want to request uh, to the higher officials in the government that uh, this is a uh, this is a time when India is uh, you know inching towards becoming a five trillion economy. When you're talking about the five trillion economy, it's very uh, the government has also announced a lot of prestigious projects into infrastructure to the tune of. 100 uh, lakh dollars. Uh, so when we are talking about these kind of high value projects, it's very important that the importance should be uh, given to, uh, not to be given to the brands which are from the non-friendly countries and against whom we are trying to bring up our security and safety infrastructure. And taking cognizance of the same uh, you know, issue, the US also banned uh, you know, amongst the thousands of the brands which are working in U.S., so U.S. Uh, pinpointed five brands and they told them to, uh, not to work in their country. Not to, only this, they told their OEM brands who were supplying the equipment or the technology to uh, Chinese companies not to uh, transfer any technology, not to uh, supply any core components to these companies. When the U.S., in spite of being such a strong country, taking such a harsh steps against these uh, these uh, brands, we should also take we India we in India we are much prone to our security and safety risks. So we should also take these kind of initiatives and give importance and uh, handhold the Indian companies in terms of their R and in terms of IPRs and patents and. Uh, creating a uh, you know, you know, uh, right platform to ensure that we live up to the expectations of not only the government but the customers also. Having said that, uh, we am we are CP Plus, we are the Indian brand, a truly Indian brand, and we are proud to be uh, Indian brand and still say India. Thank you.